Jetzt ist oh. oh. <laughs> After 20 years of success and loyal service to French tennis, Fabrice Santoro decided to hang up his racket in 2010. Due to his unusually long career, the Frenchman holds several crazy ATB records. For a player who never reaches the top 10, he has 40 wins over top 10 opponents which is considered to be the biggest in tennis history. He also has the most appearances in Grand Slam tournaments behind Roger Federer and Feliciano Lopez. But the craziest stat of them all is having the second most losses in singles play behind Feliciano Lopez with 444 losses. Fabrice is known for his cheery attitude on court and his vast arsenal of trick shots, making him a crowd favorite and gaining him the admiration of fellow players. In recognition of Santoro's unique and innovative style of play, Pete Sampras has nicknamed him the magician, which is the nickname he's known for ever since. Parfait. Tranquille. Ouh. Elle était belle cette volée, bien déposée. Ah, il souffre physiquement, Fabrice. Oh, bah, il n'en peut plus. In the second round of the US Open 2005, the little magician came up against the defending champion, Roger Federer. Before that, the two have played each other eight times, with Roger having the lead of six wins to two. However, Roger still remembers their first ever meeting back in 1999, which he lost to the Frenchman in straight sets. I always enjoy playing against me, against him. He he gave me a lesson the first time we played. You know, he he sizzled me up with his slice and his spins, and uh, and it's always a pleasure to play against him because it's just so different. You know, so we had a great match, like I announced him. The match we're talking about today is quite crazy. In one of the rarest occasions, Santoro managed to steal the spotlights from Roger and have the majority of the crowd on his side. The two have given us probably the greatest second round match in Grand Slam history with almost two hours of non-stopping entertainment. I guess this is what you expect when two of the most creative players ever face off in such a big stage. Before we get started, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more original tennis content. I know this video is quite long, but trust me, it's gonna be worth every single second of your time. Thank you so much for watching and without further ado, enjoy the video. That's one thing that we uh, we actually talked about because he, he's so on feet. Well, oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's his first magic trick of the night. I think standing O is in order. <laughs> yeah, the magician. I don't think he beat those guys with shots like that, but look at this. Uh, Murray, I mean, this guy's had a lot of wins. Don't try this if you haven't had children. I mean, it's just... It's a... No better with an easy game on. His serve, so we start the match. Easy to say from up here. Uh, <laughs> it's tough out there for Centura. He's playing well and he's down. Yeah, 
<laughs> he's working incredibly hard. He's got a chance to break back. Look at this, that passing shot again. He's talking about throwing the kitchen sink, and he's definitely he's trying to have physical game. You just don't see anybody like this, do you? Ah! Mm -hmm. he's, the, the, the if you looked at the definition of crafty in your mm -hmm. picture, you'd see his name. The crowd's even reacting to that ball that he, how he handled that ball. Two <laughs> shot. I mean, that's great. That's just fun to watch. It's fun to watch. He's down 4-1. <laughs> fun for me. Well, Teddy kept his eye on the ball here. He got to hand it to him. Look at that right there. It's a great shot. Oh, it's long. So Torres taking a long look. He can't do anything about it, obviously. You can't stop the point here like you can on clay, but to me that appeared long. So much for my eyes. To it easily. He's also fast too. Yeah. We've got to take a look in on that against Peter Vessels. I'll take that back. Now Bandians and Federer's. That's it. So there's a rarity. There's actually two other matches going to play. Oh, we went for the finish there. Oops. Oh, he's human. It's about to happen, Ted. That's amazing. Amazing. Twice serving for a set. Federer is broken. Wow. <laughs> I tell you, he drives, he drives you crazy. Somewhere. <laughs> well, that for Federer will feel better. A little more order restored. And the battle at the moment. Starting to get a little more emotional and pump himself up through action. He's, say. he's yeah. you know, muttering into himself. Mm -hmm. So much for him being rattled. Right? <laughs> he just he, just he settled himself. <laughs> Boy, is he rattled. <laughs> it's me. <laughs> But I mean, it, it, we, we laugh, but it's also. It's a great shot. <laughs> He's just saying it's pulling it. Well, that's, that is a extremely difficult. Flick the wrist to time that. And got Roger smiling.
Shows you how fast Federer is, and he tracked yep. that ball down. Look where he hit this defensive lob. I mean, <laughs> mm. Angles again. Well, it's Angles. He's, again, he ran around his forehand. Federer hesitated. Ooh. Three straight aces. <laughs> you know, John, to me, what's interesting about the man, not the service percentage doesn't mean much, but. <laughs> How good is that? To both men. Absolutely. That's why people are standing. Just keeps up. So much for the break. Stay with us. This is fun. So it's a record with an asterisk, you understand? Well, right? it's a, it's, it shows he can play for yeah. long periods. Second serve. That's some save by Santoro. You gotta look at this. This is too good. <laughs> it's better in the replays. <laughs> you just the sense is just not as comfortable. Also tougher for Santoro to reach down and hit a big serve because he's against the win. Yep. Santoro just all over. He played that just right. That's out, and Federer has taken two sets, both breaking. And then for two sets, to be on a, serving for a tie break and to suddenly have the, the best player in the world find a, a level for those three balls. Federer, it's such, a, it's such a good effort by Santoro. They run that down. And look to be wide, but called in. Fourth ace for Santoro. Your eyes are still good. It's not often that Fed Federer's going to ask us. Maybe he didn't see it. The way things are going today. What is this a rarity, huh? It is a rarity. Ah! <laughs> Still trying. Well, these are great wheels for a guy in his 30s. A lot of tennis mileage on them. That's right. I mean, he's the speedy Gonzalez here trying National Tennis Center. Oh, 
And we're staying with you for this match featuring Federer and Fabrice Santoro. Easy hole for Federer. Good to see they found shots. <laughs> and the crowd appreciating the fact Santoro is still fighting. He's, he's trying to laugh that off. He assumed that Santoro would give up on this, and he didn't. And he just... <laughs> I mean, who would have thought when he came here tonight that this would be the guy getting the standing ovations? <laughs> 98 French Open. Get back from two sets to win. Well, oh, and see, he's a little upset, old Roger there. A little head hunting. Lucas Arnold plays doubles now. His job is in jeopardy. He was like changing all those doubles rules. Santoro was. Another lefty shot. Still improvising. Six games in the first two sets. He just saved it for a time. Look at that. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> and Santoro said they're saying, you call me the magician? <laughs> what I just watched? Yeah, he said something. To, yeah. So you stink. <laughs> <laughs> it's called an exclamation, exclamation point. I like this guy. How can you not? Standing on. This is great for players to watch, isn't it? If you put out, you get rewarded. And the sports rewarded. A battle. You can smile now. So yeah, well played, Fabrice. Better believe it. That was some match. So um, I was very nervous before the match, but I think I can't play better than I did tonight. What's the most? the most difficult part about playing Roger? <laughs> Everything, you know? Everything is tough. 
you know, I was, I was so happy to play a tiebreak in the third set, and after two minutes, I watched the score. It was 6-0 for him, and I was, <laughs> I was so down. <laughs> Well, thank you for being here. Thank you for playing. Thank you for those magical Thank moments. you to everybody. Thanks a lot. Fabrice Santoro. Absolutely amazing career, and it's wonderful to have you on, on our team. And um, please welcome Rafa Nadal.